Hi, it's Greg Hughes from 90 Second Website Builder. Let me show you how the slide menu works. The slide menu is one of the tools under the navigation set of tools that allows you just another way to create navigation for your website. I'm just going to draw a box out here. It starts me off with two folders and two items in each folder. Basically, a folder would be considered a category. The items would be considered the links in your navigation. By default, it looks like this. I'm pressing F5 to preview. You can see I just have a simple navigation uh, slide menu here that of course I can edit. So let's do that. I'm going to close this preview, double click on this object and bring up the settings. Here's where you would uh, edit those categories and items. They're called folders in this case. If I wanted to change the name of the folder because it's selected I can click edit and call this something else. Click OK and then I can edit an item by doing this. Selecting the item, clicking edit and click OK. And now you can see that, of course, I can also turn this into a link. Let's go back to edit, and that's where I would do this. If I wanted to link this to a page in the project or an outside website, etc., I would do all of that here. The way this looks is, of course, set by the style. Under the style, we have different sections, the behavior of the menu, so whether the menu animates or not. Right now, it doesn't. So let's change that. Since it's a slide menu, let's give it a slide animation. Here I would change the border width, all of the colors, and all of the things like borders and background modes and those kind of things. I'm going to leave it at this for now and show you what we've changed. I'll click OK. Click F5 to preview. You can see my changes here. And now it sort of slides rather than just appears. Makes it a little bit smoother by adding that animation. Some other things we can do, and again these categories, by the way, toggle like this so you can open and close them. But another thing that we can do is we can add images. This is new in version 10 of 90 Second Website Builder. I can add an image to an item. So I'm going to click Volleyball. Let's edit that. And you can see that it gives me a spot where I can find an image. So let's go find an image that's appropriate. I actually happen to have a volleyball down here somewhere. There's one. Let's click on that and we'll say Open. Now this particular image, as you can see, has a white background. So to make that better, I could change the way this looks. So let's change the way the item background looks right now. I'm going to go to Style. And let's see, the item background. That's going to be down here under Item. Here's the style of the item. I want the background color. Let's make it white so it looks better against that volleyball. We'll go like this. There's the border color. We can leave all that. Text color, that's all fine. When I hover on this item, it's going to look like this. I think I'll leave that for now. And we'll click OK. And now you can see it's going to look a little bit better, at least in that state. So we'll click F5. And here's our new slide menu with a little icon next to it. Now remember, the size of the icon is going to determine how big this section is. And it affects all of them. So you can see that the size of this image made these be a little bit wider. So you want to be mindful of the images that you use, if you use an image at all, that it will do that. So let's go take a look at some of those options. I'm going to double click and again let's edit this and change that image just to see what it does. If we go with a larger image, for example, uh, maybe something, in fact this will probably be too large, but it will give us an idea of what happens when you use a larger image. Well, let's just pick this. I know this is a larger image. And if I say OK, if I say Open, and then click OK, OK again, you can see that it did expand all of these because they stay the same. They stay consistent and they're going to match whatever the largest image is. So that's important to know. Again, we preview and it's working fine. We just need to know that the size of the images is going to affect how the menu looks. But it does give you a lot of great flexibility and creative opportunities when you're creating navigation, especially with the slide menu here in version 10 of 90 Second Website Builder.